If your focus is elemental analysis, watch this to accelerate your results. We're here in the application lab in Hemel Hempstead, and I'm with an expert in elemental analysis, Brian Murray. Brian, we have a blockbuster product and technology in the ICAP 6000 series. The 6000 series really comprises of three instruments. All the instruments in the range will deliver the same analytical performance, so that the range really tries to cater for sample throughput requirements, flexibility requirements of, of customers. But looking at the range of products that will deliver the same analytical performance, we can really supply instruments at the low end of the, the product range, the, the ICAP 6200, for very routine applications like environmental analysis, toy testing, where the same analysis is done day in, day out, all the way through to the 6500 series, where you can add on accessories, get full instrument control, the software is fully featured. So the researcher has really all tools available to them. We have a benefit of being able to deliver the right application requirements with the right sample throughput. I mean, one example would be looking at the wear metals and oils, where you know they have a huge number of samples. We have some customers which maybe have two or three instruments running 24 hours a day, seven days a week. They require reliability, which the product offers, but they also require that it can handle difficult samples like oils, wear metals, to try and uh, determine component failures uh, and look to see where the wear within engines is taking place. And they're at the ICAP delivers that in the, in the radio version of the system. So Brian, talk about the range of detection and technologies. One of the main strengths of the ICAP uh, range of products is that the detection limits that are achievable are really only governed by the, the torch configuration. So we have an axle and a radial uh, or dual configuration. The ICAP delivers PPB type uh, detection limits. Obviously for environmental analysis where you're looking at drinking waters, where the ultimate detection limits are required, we can use the dual configuration for the petrochemical industry. The requirements are slightly less, so we trade off a little bit of detection capabilities with the radio system for mm -hmm. robustness in the plasma to deal with those, those organic samples. And what about the total cost of ownership story here? The cost of ownership was, was a key design feature of the ICAP, really from its conceptions. A lot of the optics and, and the design concepts within the instrument are aimed at reducing the gas consumptions, the electricity consumptions the cost of consumables, the number of consumable parts within the system mm -hmm. to really drive down that cost of ownership so that when people look at it long term, they can see the value, not only in the performance, but in the, the financial side of things. Discover more ideas and innovations. Visit thermoscientific.com.